Guess what time it is? It's one o'clock, honey. It's one o'clock. What's up? What's up, baby boo? Hey, homie, where you from? Where you from, homie? What's up? Cheers, guys. It's my medicine. I oh, need my medicine. If not, I will just literally die. All right, guys. Well, I'll be cooking something quick, you know? Yeah, you know me. I love me my chicken thighs, okay? You know, I dress up just for you. I put some lipstick dick, 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 on. That's it, okay? Um, chicken thighs are my favorite. So, very simple. I will make it for you. I will show you. And you can make it a one, two, three, four, five, six, okay? All right, so this is what you need. Olive oil. 21 seasoning. If you don't have that, that's cool. Black pepper. Either onion salt or garlic salt. But, you know, I just decided to do a combo of sorts, okay? Um, and that's it. And thyme and rosemary. If you don't have rosemary, if you don't have thyme, that's cool. That's fine. Okay, I drizzled about, I mean, this is about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did about eight. But, you know, if you feel like you need to do more, then more. Okay, uh, I massaged it. I talked to sweet nothings in its ear. I said, baby boo, thank you for not willingly giving up your life, but thank you. Thank you. You taste delicious. Um, it's my favorite. So anyway, my soldier, talk to it, thank it, be grateful and, uh, let it sit for, depends on how hungry you are. I'm hungry. So I'm going to let it sit for an hour. Okay. And I'm going to serve it with some side of Yasmin rice, which is my favorite from Trader Joe's and, um, maybe some beets on the side or some, you know, but this is a quick little meal and then you're going to put it in the oven. In my Mexican oven. Oh, look, 11-11, that's a sign. You know, because it's always packed because I'm Mexican, okay? I always fill this shit up, okay? <laughs> so I'm going to take that out, and I'm going to let it preheat for, depends, either 375 for um, 40 minutes or higher. I will let you know once I decide, okay? But meanwhile, <laughs> look at all the lipstick. I decided, I'm like, oh, my God, I'm going to wear lipstick today. And look, it's almost gone. Oh, yeah. All right, so I added a little bit of paprika just to make it interesting. Okay. And now I am going to put it in the oven. Voila. For 400, at 400 degrees for about 35 to 45 minutes. And at the end, uh, you'll see once it's crispy, I'm, I always add a little butter at the end. And I might end up doing pasta with this because I'm craving pasta right now okay and I'll show you how Yum. see you in 40 or 35 we'll see how crispy it is all right so I grabbed a handful of spaghetti for myself okay I added olive oil and salt and you let it boil al dente so whatever you want okay if it's like if you feel like it needs more cooking then you add more water but the point is, you do not want the water to completely leave, okay? If you feel like that's happening and the, the, the pasta's not done, then add a little bit of more water because you definitely want to save the pasta water because that's what makes the pasta, like, juicier, okay? So, let that boil. Then I'm going to fry garlic, onions, I'm gonna add some lemon, pepper. I'm, I'm craving olives tonight, so I love olives. If you don't like olives, then you can do without. Um, better than bouillon, of course. And of course, butter. So I'm gonna add the chicken on top of that and you'll see how it's done, okay? Happy cooking! See how nice and crispy it already is? Well, I'm just adding butter on top, okay? chicken. I'll let it sit for another minute. I'm going to let the butter melt and put it back in there. And once I take it out, I'm going to let it sit for five minutes. And that's it, guys. Yum. 
All right, so now that I took it out, I'm gonna let it sit. I'm gonna cover it with aluminum foil and let it sit for another five minutes, okay? Now my pasta, see this is what you want. You want a little bit of that pasta water. So I'm gonna put that in a bowl right now. Boom, and then I'm gonna show you what I do at, with this after, okay? I'm gonna season this and you'll see. All right. So, same pot that I cooked the pasta in, I added, drizzled a little bit of olive oil, added garlic and onions, capers, and the um, Casta Villarano, whatever, olives, because I'm craving olives. Now, if you don't like olives, you can just do onions and garlic, or garlic by itself, okay? Then once I do this, do pepper, okay? I'm gonna add a little bit, maybe a half a teaspoon of the Better Than Bouillon. Okay, and once that happens, I'm gonna add the pasta, and then I'm gonna add some lemon on top, a little bit of butter to end it, and that's it for the pasta. Okay, and then I'm gonna add this delicious chicken on top. And that's it. butter and that's it. And maybe just half a tablespoon of butter. That's it. Mm, mm, mm. All right, so there you go. Now what I like to do, I love uh, getting this delicious chicken fat right here. It's like bacon. Mmm. To add it on top. This is literally the best thing ever. Okay, I added a little bit of red pepper flakes on the pasta. And that's it. You're done. Friday meal. Enjoy. <laughs>